कि आज का ये जो हमारा सेशन है ये हमारी जो मेमल रेमेडीज है उनके ऊपर है और आज का ये जो सेशन है इसको हमारे रिस्पेक्टेड एंड सीनियर मेंटर डॉक्टर घनश्याम कलाथिया सर होस्ट करने वाले हैं वो आज के हमारे इस सेशन के स्पीकर हैं तो इंटरनेशनल स्पीकर हैं सर अलग अलग हमारे जो इंटरनेशनल जर्नल्स हैं सेमिनार्स हैं और उनका जो खुद का क्लिनिक भी है तो मतलब इंटरनेशनल लेवल पर उनके पेशेंट उनके पास रहते हैं तो हर साल सर एक ऑनलाइन वेबिनार भी करते हैं सेमिनार भी करते हैं जिसमें वो थाउजेंड्स ऑफ होम्योपैथ को टीच करते हैं तो अभी जस्ट अभी स्टार्ट ही हुआ है कल पहला सेशन था सर का तो हम हमारी आई फैमिली की ओर से सबसे पहले तो सर का वेलकम करते हैं वेलकम सर अ वेरी गुड इवनिंग सर ओके सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट मेमल ग्रुप ऑफ रेमेडीज एंड ट्राई टू मेक यू अवेयर व्हाट आर द जनरल थीम्स ऑफ मेमल्स एंड हाउ टू अंडरस्टैंड देम फ्रॉम वेयर दिस ऑल थीम्स कमिंग एंड ऑल सो व्हाट आई नो अबाउट मेमल रेमेडीज आई वांट टू शेयर विथ यू वेलकम टू मेमल so uh, before starting or before the going uh, further i want to have a conversation rather than kind of a dry lecturing so i have a question like what you have ideas about mammal in nature so you have to write down in chat if chat is available or either open your microphone and you can speak uh, sir good evening sir yeah good evening they always yeah sir uh, mammals uh, they have mammary glands and they give rise to young ones ek second ek second uh, panna ma'am aur gurveen ma'am please one by one to so, panna ma'am ji yeah. aap continue kijiye okay. thank you Uh, yeah. without family and without group uh they cannot think their life you know okay so one so is they are living group. in group yeah they feel unsafe unsecure unprotected and alone yeah but what mammal feels in nature we don't know right so at least we have to know like they they will they require a group that is one thing yes yeah second thing uh they are dependent on their family no it's our speculation it's not a homeopathic point of view it's in nature how mammal is differentiated from rest of other animals from snakes from spiders scorpion fish how mammals are differentiated from them this is my question okay sir so, mammals usually the nurturing element is exaggerated yes why mammal called a mammal why this name is given this is important yes sir yes sir and of this so they have mammary glands and they give rise to young ones that is why they are called as mammals yes perfect so memory gland is very very important in mammals because they are nurturing their young ones in compared to reptiles and other animals right so this is their basic natural quality now we have few more qualities you you see here this is unique in mammals memory gland now as you say they are social they require a group this is another quality this is third quality what is it any idea 
some animal feed on uh, vegetable things and some mammals feeding on other animals so some are herbivorous and some are carnivorous right so if you know these all the natural qualities then this all the qualities you see in homeopathic point of view and you can correlate them and you can remember them i think if you understand this way then you can remember them in your entire life so this is herbivore this is carnivore now we have to see these all the qualities on the base of homeopathic point of view me versus you is the main theme it's animal quality right now tell me what you know about mammals in a homeopathy a homeopathic point of view what do you know about mammals as a group as a remedy maternal in uh, instinct exaggerated yes. yes one thing is their maternal instinct other things they like to remain group yes group so group has a theme of dependency and independency right need of and sociability relations giving and taking kind of tone they have it i had given so much they i not receive anything so given taken kind of a language is there right yeah anything else in the group hmm and the mirror yes. so to speak one only one person swarna ma'am aap bolie prepare from the milk milk yeah that is of but we do not find many a uh, correlation with milk because in home if they if you check in repertory milk desire milk aggravation uh, anywhere you find a lot of different different remedies so only milk related characteristic is not there in mammals there are few other characteristic are there uh, specific general uh, symptoms are there but not only a milk okay let's go now we try to see all themes mammalian themes one by one the first important theme is need to belong to a group so whenever you are dealing with any case you find a polarity where person at one hand dependent and another hand you also find desire to be independent in some cases some cases they are okay with dependency so when they talk about dependency person may say like i'm secure with the a group strong need of friend family relation that way also you find them person has a habit to sacrifice i had done lot for my son lot for my daughter lot for my parents or parents says i had done lot for my uh, kids so this kind of language you found in mammal remedies community society person is very very active for their community their caste their friend circle society they living housing society so very kind of uh, you can say the their emphasis is a lot on relationship and not only one they have many many circles and very good way they can handling all the circles as friend circle school friend circle college friend circle working place uh, or co worker friend circle so multiple way even relation also father side relations mother side relation wife side relation husband side relation so maintaining this all relation rhythmically with very good uh, grip over them so this way the mammal group is very social right so bond attachment i am attached so much with my kid so multiple way you can find these qualities now opposite polarity is independent no need of anybody so at that moment person might say i require a freedom i am okay with friend no problem but at least i need to be spend time for myself excluded rejected nobody considering me 
So somebody is exclude you, not considering you. So you put effort to be in that friend circle or any group or in the family, anywhere. Like a mother-in-law is not considering me. So I need to do a little more. So they have a value of me. So this is the way you find a talk in mammal cases. Now another quality. Conflict of dependent and independent. So if person is dependent on a group, then you find a docility. Person is very mild natured, submissive. Uh, you can say yielding kind of personality, very uh, adjusting kind of personality. So person has a lot of good heart, kindness, love, care. This quality you family oriented, family is everything for me. Group is everything for me. My home is my heaven. And person tend to adjust his own desires and wishes and everything for this group. So this is the way you found dependency. Now opposite is person is dominant. So controlling the entire group for their uh, or overpowering other or prefer to be a top guy. And that's why in mammal we find a very strong characteristic of hierarchy. Somebody is the boss. So boss giving order you and you have to follow. So some prominent personality is there, head of the family, head of uh, uh, one person is going to decide everything. So this way you find lot of independent kind of opposite polarity also. Next theme is importance of relationship that already we talked, right? complex relation, emotional attachment. So these are the mammal qualities. Again, issue of hierarchy, which is also very impurity complex, superiority complex. I'm better than them. My family is better than them. So comparison is also there. Like somebody is a low rank, inferior than others, dominant, a suppressed, highly a social status is also important. So kind of a ego also attach with their ranking, a social status. And for that they do or put lot of effort. Suppose during case taking, suppose person say I am so ambitious. Then when you ask and go deep, then this ambitiousness is why I have to earn lot of money? Because I have a social status. I have a good car. I have a good uh, branded clothes and that gives me special status in society. So this is the way you find. So high rank, superiority, submissive. This way you find hierarchy issue in cases. Sir, sorry. Hmm. Sir, you said dependency and independent. Hmm. Conflict of being. So independent uh, when one person is dominating. Mm. So, what they are feeling and why they want to become independent? The mammals usually stay in group. So yeah, they want but to independent. independent. They say this is one person is too much dominating, right, sir? Mm. Uh, the independence is very strong in carnivorous mammals, and dependency is very strong in herbivorous mammals. So, this is the way also you can differentiate, right? Because if lion has to has to hunt the cow, then lion need to overpower it. So they have an independency. They have desire to make a decision for their own self. Autocracy is also there. Nobody is a boss over me. This feeling is very strong in them. But even in uh, um, herbivorous uh, mammals, prey mammals, we call it simply a prey mammal and predatory mammal, right? So in prey mammal also certain way you also find desire to be independent. I had done so much. I had spent my entire life for my family. Now I want to spend a little time because I'm, I get retired now. So I have to spend life for myself. So that language also fine. But the dependency polarity is very strong there and a minimal, uh, uh, expression related to independency you found in prey mammals and in predatory mammal independency is very strong 
and dependency you find a very minimal in them okay okay next theme is maternal instinct this is the core theme you find in mammal remedies so person want to have a motherly love or either person gives motherly love to anybody so it's all related to care warmth nurturing hugging kissing tempering you find multiple way maternal kind of quality like mother like love you find over uh, so much in these remedies another way you can find parents are over protective towards their kid they have lot of anxiety related to their kids not only health issue or small small thing they are taking care of their kids and another uh, angle kids get so or uh, feel so restricted by parents because parents give so much importance to small small things so kids want to have a freedom so dependency and independence this thing run through and through in mammal cases multiple ways they say like my parents are so much protective they are tiki giving me so much care whatever even i want some something without asking they provide everything but this too much love is not good for me so i want to be on my own i don't know my parents decide everything for me so i don't know what to do so now it too much i want to be on my own that way also you find in cases or either person has no mother in life so missing mother or there is no good relation with mother but in short person is very affectionate very loving caring kind of personality as like a phosphorus phosphorus kind of quality you find here or you can say if you have to compare with a uh, uh, mineral remedies then you can see qualities of rose tree natrium magnesium and all silica and hot phosphorus sulfur all because their their core issue is care warmth and nurturing nobody understand me nobody i have no value nobody is caring me or suppose person give example like i do not want to depend on anybody and when you ask a question suppose you become a depend on somebody what happen and person reply if i become dependent then who will take care of me who give me food who give me a uh, a support moral support everything they talk about what we see in a family kind of environment another way you find maternal instinct is sibling rivalry they have lot of fight with between the brother and sister or brother and brother or sister and sister or either person want to missing those days when person is in a childhood and mother and father and all living together and family have a very good life so they want want to be baby another hand for a, a lady want to be a mother so even in a office in a workplace person behaving as if the as if that lady is a mother of entire co-workers so multiple way you find maternal instinct in these remedies so mother child bondage is also very strong not child not want to leave mother mother not want to leave child multiple way you find this quality these are the elements from you find in mammal remedies separation from mother or parents or family because of job the they shift to another house or another city and then all issue started or after marriage all issue started shifting to hostel and all issue started so you find this element from separation from the mother parents or family very strong in these remedies element of lack of nutrition and nourishment in childhood any way they have not good family or maybe a orphan or any way uh, not good earning so they miss that attachment towards the mother and father or parents in their childhood 
lack of love or no enough bondage with mother in childhood death of child element from death of child child die when she was 30 year now she is 30 or uh, 60 year but still she is missing that child and even in some cases you find it's a still birth also the baby die while delivery so though the lady is missing that child so much so this quality you find in nemas or either death of very deeply loved one what is the characteristic strong character characteristic of umbra grisha death of many family members one after another right yes sir yeah this is you find in it repertory also and it's matriya medica also so this is not limited to umbra grisha it is for all members no enough feeding new birth of sibling or sibling rivalry so till baby has no problem but new baby arrive and then all problem start behavior issue start get angry all these issue start so in pediatric cases you find this element from now affinities which symptoms are very prominent in mammal remedies so lactation and menses that we all know even a uh, breast heaviness or painful before during or after menses that we already know in lac and lac diploritum right complain of ovaries hormones uterus fear of snakes snake fear is very very not only snake reptiles because mammals main predator in general is reptile group of animals in nature and that's why fear of snake is very strong in mammal remedies many mammal remedies have headache issues multiple way you find headache issue nutritional problem bulimia anorexia that we already know ocd obsessive compulsive disorder is very strong in mammal remedies panic attack anxiety especially smaller size mammal or prey mammal you find this calling this affinity so strong developmental issue asd autism and adhd so these are the affinities now if you have any question then we'll discuss otherwise we go to a case because whatever we had discuss this theme i want to show you how this all things you can find ji please boliye agar kisi ka koi question okay let's start ji sir continue kijiye sir this is a case of 54 year old female from bulgaria who is suffering from chronic fatigue syndrome with severe vertigo so my first question is tell me everything about you and your problem and she replied i have had this weakness for many years i get tired easily i cannot walk for half an hour or stand even for 20 minutes i need to lie down after my household activities this is how i work so i wake up and work for some time then i have to lie down for a while then i get up and work again and then lie down again for some time so she lie down and work lie down and work this is the way she complete her household activity continuous work is impossible for me and in 3 months i have had new problem i get dizziness vertigo when i am lying it is also coming in attacks so vertigo comes in attacks there are days when i do not have any then one day the attack comes and goes when it comes i cannot even open my eyes i have to close my eyes like this and she shows me gesture covering the eye and sit like this supporting and sitting taking a back This is the only way I feel better and can can tolerate what I go. Otherwise, it torments me. What I go is tormenting you. This is a personification. What I go is like a person and giving you a problem. This type of language you often found in animal kingdom remedies. So ask the question: How does it start? And she replied. 
I generally lay down on bed like this and she show me on left side. Whenever I turn from straight lying position to left side, I feel dizzy. So turning on left side goes. So this way you have to also find a symptoms that you can look in rapidly or materially America because these are the primary information, right? Then after we try to understand the person. So primary information, you can look in repertory and materia medica. So this is also very important to, to note them and you need to be very focused to understand. Them. So we have a, a, any case taking, we have a two targets, collect the symptoms. So you can look them in any way, whatever way you are practicing and try to understand the person. So here, these are the symptoms that are going to help us to look them in repertory or Mati America. Gradually the vertigo becomes severe and it worsen whenever I lie down on my left side or raise my head even a little from pillow. It is hard for me to raise my head above the pillow. Once I get up there is no problem. But if I lift my head up from pillow my head become terrible. I am lucky that the vertigo is not constant. Otherwise, how would have lived my life? My life would have become a hell. I have so many problems and this vertigo is pouring oil in, into those. So now she start crying. So here also you see a little psychological touch in case also a kind of a depression is also there along with vertigo. But here you find few peculiar expression like vertigo is periodical. This will help us in confirming the miasm also. Because it's not a constant. It's coming and going, coming and going. So kind of periodicity is also there. So because of period, periodicity you can correlate it with miasm, malaria miasm. But it is not necessary in each and every case that you have to confirm everything right if you come on the mammal only like if this case is look like a mammal then you can confirm with the help of repertory or materia medica and you can decide the medicine so ask the question i understand so how did this problem affect you everything started when i lost my job so now you see the cause and you have to understand it how that cause is looking her perception and how this all the things affecting her. My husband has been retired for many years, but I had my job. So we were living our life very happily, but suddenly they fired me and we both become dependent on our son. I'm still looking for a job, but because of this weakness, how can I work? And now she cries loudly. So now you see the dependency, one expression coming up, right? If there is a only a single expression you found, on that base you do not have to decide the medicine, especially a group like this is the mammal only. You have to confirm it repeatedly on mammal way of expression also you found. Even whatever themes we discussed today, the only thing is not going to help you to decide any group of remedy. At least two, three things must be there in things. Okay. You know very well that when a person becomes jobless, they have no value in the family. This is the language of mammal remedy. As well as the society. Now both of us have become like a servant in our house. This is mammal language. Of course, we love to help our son and daughter in law and they also love us, but in the end, we are dependent on them. Now, she says, I, I, want, I am a dependent, but what is her desire? To be independent, right? When I, I had a job, I was independent. My husband has a job. We are independent. So this Dependency and the independency comes in polarity. But you have to decide which pole is very strong.
we have to ask for money if we have to buy some clothes some gifts on our birthdays in reality nobody love you when you are not working so we agree to help them with household chores dependency no value in the family and society becoming servant like nobody loves me this is mammal language once we know the core of the case we need to explore to obtain everything required to confirm the medicine so we require more confirmation this is a first soft hint now both of us have accepted this situation but my physical issues are harassing me from time to time so this is again confirmation of malaria myism ask the question how you accept this situation yes because we are social animals this is the way mammal can talk so we are not able to live our life without society friend or family we need to have their support even you you are financially independent you need emotional support i do not know about others but i cannot live without the love and care of my family and friends i need to call my parents every week although they are very old now now imagine 54 56 year old lady talking like i need to call my parents a married lady tell you like i need to call my parents every week this is unusual right this is you strongly found in mammal cases attachment with not only parents anybody so much deep attachment so social animal concern for family friends and society this is again confirmatory symptoms or expression of mammal remedies now our next step is we have a 100 remedies in mammal group so which medicine we have to think of so our next step now we know become sure like this is a mammal case so our next step is to find specific remedy so sir i have moved here with my husband after our marriage but i have always re- remained in touch with my parents yes of course i have always tried to satisfy my family by taking care of them but i do have my personal life too this is the dependency and independency language i too need support and care i do not have big expectations but at least they need to say something to me or give me a gift even a small flower so in return i had given and i want to take something this is the language you found so prominent in me mammal remedies doing a lot for others this is you found specifically in cattle a bovid family but it's a too much you do not have if you are a beginners then you do not have to think so much about a uh, classification and groups and all at least you have to match the materia medica and repertory and also you are able to select the medicine so i just ignite do you love your family just who pushing to go further and she reply yes very much even more than my life i have always fulfilled their wishes first then if time is left i do what i want to do for myself i am taking care of my daughter in law as if she is my own daughter imagine in a foreign country the good mother in law kind of relation with daughter in law you imagine this is out of the box thing right because in abroad they do not have so much deep, so much deep relations it's a kind of indian situation you can imagine here where you have a very strong bondage with family and all because we have very strong family relations here but she is from bulgaria and though you find very good attachment with daughter in law we have never never fought since she came to our house after the marriage i never wish to fight with any one i hardly get angry i always remain silent even if i am badly insulted i am always keeping everything inside and 
and if it is too much i cry alone but cannot share it with others others see me as a happy and positive person but inside i have much much sorrow and sadness i am certainly a happy person but due to this physical issues i am becoming more and more sad now you see the person is not taking a fight with other not so much anger so kind of submissive kind of personality right very yielding pulsatile kind of primary we require considering others desire and wishes on top of her needs indicate level of her dependency docility is there submissiveness is there this all you can see in bovid group of primary status a mild and silent very ordinary their focus is only how score and this kind of things only so ask the question okay now we will not talk about your life describe word dependent as absurdly as you can now i again put a hard step to make decision for any specific remedy so she replied dependent means someone else is taking care of you you are totally helpless i get dreams in which i am lost i get separated from my family or group i do not know anybody there and because of my shy nature i cannot ask any one for help so it is a helpless situation for me what do you mean by helpless alone forsaken nobody is there to help you to take care of you or at least assure that you don't worry i am with you so this is important and finally i asked the question about uh, confirmatory question about her favorite color and she love the intense dependency and fear to get separated and losing contact with the group this is very 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 strong in leg deplorator this is from material medical point of view right now you see kingdom animalia dreams dependency all it's a mammal expression so like different deploratum taking care of others until neglecting one desperately need others in society there is no value shy and docile tolerate everything rather than complain these are the cow quality in nature also but i do not totally rely on material medical point of view only that's why i had done repetitive work also i selected one area rather than putting everything in repetitive is called sectorial repetitization so i selected one prominently exclude sector of the entire case and i put all these important rubric in repetitive and you find like the protein coming up so strong what i go lying aggravation side of the man to raising head aggravation what i go opening eyes aggravation what i go sitting while aggravation so i have prescribed like deploratum 200 one dose two times for one day and in 18 month her all the problem get resolved initially she required 200 c and even uh totally she require a doses of lac defloratum 200 c so this is the case now if you have any question but problem in people who already even know mammal things and these remedies to decide the medicine because all look like a lac defloratum or lac canina then what to do you need to acquire knowledge of each remedy at least i'm not say like you have to put enormous effort and understand all 100 available remedies but at least prominent remedies that useful in our daily practice like uh like defloratum like caprinum like ovinum like equinum delphinum these remedies you need to know if you have a collective understanding then also while case taking you can differentiate them easily
ओके अनदर थिंग आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर शेयर हियर मी एंड आई हैव अ वन टीम ऑफ पीपल वी आर डूइंग एक्टिविटी फ्रॉम सेवनटीन जानुवारी टू सेवनटीन फेब्रुवारी वन मंथ एंड कोर्स काइंड ऑफ अ कोर्स प्री कोर्स वेर वी आर शेयरिंग अवर क्लिनिकल एक्सपीरियंसिस सो यू कैन जॉइन दैट एक्टिविटी ऑल्सो बिकॉज इट इज अ फ्री एक्टिविटी and uh, you can enjoy all teachers at least we have seven eight teachers going to talk live as we had today here on youtube because yesterday we had a uh, session on zoom but uh, zoom has limitation of 100 and nearly more than 1000 people have a desire to join so it was not so good outcome so we are thinking to have the same kind of session tomorrow with a speaker from usa and she will explain her clinical experiences in that uh, live session so that's it uh if you want to learn this mammal remedies then we have a, a set of books two volumes all remedy Hundred remedies and the materia medica and many cases and uh, group themes and their family group themes. As we talk here, bovidi, then we have a equidi also, suidi also. So multiple uh, families are also there in mammal. So this way you have a better understanding of this collectively. Uh, this book is since two or three years. i had written and published but i am so happy i don't know what it is happy to see because many many homeopath take benefit of them and they have very good a uh, number of mammal cases now they are able to see because once they have a good collective study of mammal remedies then they are able to see a mammal cases in their practice and big headache was there before because even though person feel like this is a mammal case they are not able to decide the medicine but after this book people easily able to select medicine because collectively uh, they have a good materia medica so it's immensely going to have everyone okay If you have any question queries, you can write me on my email address or uh, on my WhatsApp also or uh, Telegram, and you can communicate with me any time. Another activity we are doing is helping hand activity, mission helping hand, where uh, I allow a homeopath, a dedicated homeopath in my live cases. I I show you how how I am doing my case taking. so if you are interested then you can also join that activity also it's a year long going activity where up till now we had done 60 cases more than 60 cases in different different groups so i will not allow you all but i select five a uh, different people and they can watch my live online cases and after case taking i explain then everything all step of case taking along with which medicine selected so we have very healthy discussion after case taking so this course is also free but only condition is because i have to run my house right my family so i take consulting only consulting charge if you refer your patient because you can refer your patient also if you have any stuck case who is not you do you are not able to decide which medicine to think then you have a, a double thing your patient is also get all right and you can learn also how to deal when you get stuck when you are not able to think when you make mistake if you are able to see uh, your mistakes in somebody somebody else taking a history and and you will miss it's really helping okay